How's it going, guys? It makes me vibes here. I just want to say I hope your day has been good. I hope it's been filled with love and positivity, and I genuinely hope it's been going your way. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I make spirituality slash self-improvement content to improve your life and to make you think to make you better 1% each day. I wanted to briefly talk about peer awareness and how to transition from out here to in here to in here. You know, throughout the day, the mind it's like a never ending treadmill and thoughts, memories, obligations, what you feel like you have to do, your personality are all projections of the mind. They are all from the state of pure consciousness. Pure consciousness is just is. The reason that life feels so heavy is because it's almost as if there's a veil that's been covered and we no longer can observe from this awareness. Observing is the key. It's not something that you can see. It's not something you can say, oh, I got it. Like, yes, like that's, that's awareness or Yes, I see what you mean. It's not something to be seen. It's something to be felt. Sometimes we go through hardships. Sometimes life will kick us down and we will get to a point of awakening. You know, awakening is not this big, oh my goodness, like big feeling of, oh my God, I got it. Because even... Even that picture that you got it, this image, that it's this big esoteric understanding or enlightenment is also a projection. Pure awareness is imageless. There is no, there's no images, there's no memories, there's no thoughts. It's just observing in your stillness. And we all have this within us. Whether you believe it or not, pure consciousness and being is in all true living beings. You have to just take time and be with yourself and let it unfold. Remove the veil. But don't, don't go out into the world and try to do it. There's nothing you can try to do to feel this power within you. There's nothing that you can read. There's nothing that you can listen to or grasp that's going to truly allow you to feel that being within you. It comes from wherever you are right now. You could be in the United States. You can be in China. You can be in New Zealand. No matter where you are, wherever you are, take space. Leave the world behind for a minute and just sit still and observe. Your mind is going to race because that's, that's the job. The mind is here to race. It's here to, to flutter you, to make you feel flustered, to make you feel that, you know, to make you to feel overwhelmed with emotions. Observe all of that. Don't try to flush it away. Don't try to push it to a side because even the effort to try to be still creates tension. Sit still, observe it. Allow it to come just like a breeze. Allow it to, like the breeze that, that's outside right now, allow it to just come, allow it to go. There's this ancient monk, and he and his followers would go to a temple. His practice was to let his followers have an hour, thousands of people, an hour to themselves to talk, do, say out loud, anything that they wanted to do. Just let, just, 
I mean, just verbiage. Just say whatever. After that hour, majority, if not everybody, laid down on the floor and just rested. Naturally, he didn't give them any instructions other than you have an hour to say, do, or whatever. Some people got naked. Some people act like they were on the phone at work. Some people just spit out things in their conscience of what was going on. Some people talk to themselves. After an hour, everybody just laid on the floor. Because at a certain point, you have to return back to your being. And what is that being? Stillness. They told the monk that that was the best 10 minutes. He gave them 10 minutes to lay on the floor. That 10 minutes was the best that they had ever felt in a while. It was the best that they ever felt in a while. And some say that it was the best they ever felt. Because they were empty. And so you can do that same thing right here. You don't have to go out into the world. You don't have to go to a temple. You can if you want to, but you can do this right from the comfort of your home, right in your car, wherever you are. Return to that space of being. Sit. Turn off the distractions and let that peace overtake you. Observe. Listen. That pure awareness is what we're all seeking. Some say it, some don't. But that that being is is how you move, right? It, it it will it will take care of all your earthly obligations. It will harmonize with everything you have in your life. That light will be a beacon to others. It will shine. You will exuberate love and compassion love and compassion is not something that you speak of it's not something that you do it's something that you are my prayer for today is that throughout your busy day I ask that sit with yourself for five minutes if you can spare five minutes throughout your day, put your phone on Do Not Disturb, turn it off, turn off the TV, turn off the music. Sit silently with yourself. Observe from this space. Thoughts are going to race. Let them, let them come and go. Take deep breaths. For the first minute, focus on your breath. And just allow yourself to relax. Don't try to relax. Allow yourself to relax and return to your being. And my prayer is that you feel deeply what I'm saying. If you can truly understand what I'm saying, this is life changing. Th this is a life changing fact. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for all the love, the kindness, the generosity that you guys have been leaving in the comments. It is truly appreciated. I hope you have a good rest of your evening. I hope that you find the time to decompress today. And just remember, this pure awareness is all there is. Okay. Love you, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.